Brought to you by Earth. On YouTube, enhance and mobile advertising on Facebook. Okay, this is my cantaloupe garden. It's uh, zone 6 in southern Illinois, May the 19th or 20th, and I have to uh, reseed these. I've got some of them uh, that are growing out. I've got one, two, three, and four. Okay, so this is five and six. There used to be some growing here, but the one thing I made a mistake on was these strings. Until they get out bigger, I'm going to have to take and disconnect them from those sticks because those strings are clipping off the tops of my cantaloupes. I know for sure that I lost three of them, two over there and two over here. A lot of these didn't grow out, so I'm going to have to reseed them. I'm going to do that here before long. And uh, the the reason why I'm going to do it is because uh, I planted these on September the 22nd. It's been three weeks, so I'm not going to waste any time and just put them in there now so that I can have more growing by the time uh, June comes because I might have to replant in June, so it all depends. So I waited three weeks and went a couple days over, and now after that I'm going to go ahead and just uh, reseed the ones that were in here so that is how that turned out I didn't get anything popping up on these and it's probably because of all the heavy rain we've gotten so and this is the watermelons I still don't know how to identify them so I'm letting whatever grows in there grow it doesn't look like very much is popping out so that might not that might not be working out too well. I've been watching them, and hopefully something does come, but I I just don't see it. I could be wrong though. Okay, this is May the thirty first, two thousand and nineteen, zone six in southern Illinois. And this is an update on our cantaloupe uh, bed. And so far we've got all of them growing except for one, two, three, four, and five up there. Now after we get these tall enough, I'll hook up those strings onto the sticks and they'll grow up them hopefully. But here's what they look like. And we might have something growing out here for those uh, mini watermelons. I also found out that they were actually cucumbers with a lemony taste. So next year I'll be growing, or later I'll be growing them in the vegetable area. And there we go. Okay, it's June the 10th, 2019 in Zone 6 in Southern Illinois, and this is an update on my cantaloupes. I have three transplants right here. I just put them down today. Then I have these right here. Started training those two to where they'll go up the string. Um, they're just now starting and I'll start training this one here before long. Um, I've got a transplant that I transplanted yesterday here and here. They're doing fine. I've got these two right here that aren't ready to be trained. I haven't put anything in there yet. I'm going to give these a little while and first I'm going to put another transplant right here and then I'll look at this and see if I can put one beside what's there or not. This is the 
first transplant I had already done that I showed on my earlier video. It was lanky at first. It drooped over, but the next day it got up and did pretty good. So these are the ones. And right here, I'm starting to train all of these. And they're getting pretty tall now. These two, all through, all of these back here are getting trained. These are already coming up to the trellis, except for that one. Now I'm going to have to train them to where they'll go this way, possibly. They might do it on their own, I don't know. And I'm going to have to put wood here, maybe here, and then right there to get it to where it goes up. But this is what I got. Let's see if I can get it a shot. Take another one on the other side. share, make comments. We love feedback.